In this lesson, I'm going to show you how to label features in a layer. In this particular case, I'm going to zoom. Let's just zoom in on a particular area first, because so you can see it. Let me get right down in there. Okay, so now we're looking at some properties on the screen. I am going to come over here to my table of contents, right click on PID, left click on properties, and up here I'm going to click on the labels tab. What field do I want to label? In this particular case, I'm going to place what's called the PID number on it. And if I wanted to change it, I could just pick any any um, field or data type in this, data column in this. But I'm going to stick with PID. We want the PID number on there, and I'll click OK. Now I'll right click on here, and then I'll left click on Label Features. And you can see the PID numbers all appear. Now, it's kind of a jumbled mess. You can manipulate that away to make it look a little bit more presentable. Uh, right click on PID, I'll left click on Properties. Uh, I'll come over here and I'll click on the Placement Properties button. And then I'll click, I'll switch this from uh, try horizontal first and then straight, straight, and then only place the label inside the polygon. That way, if it can't fit it inside the property, it's not going to display it. And that takes away your clutter. And I'll leave this at place one label per feature part. And then click OK. And then I'll click apply here. And I'll click OK and you can see it looks a lot more presentable. Now you'll see that there are some properties that don't have a PID number in them, but if I zoom in on those, you can see that it is there as you zoom in. I zoom back, I zoom back, and I keep zooming out. Now you'll notice the farther out you get, the slower it takes to label, and it will only label where it can fit them in, so there's a lot that don't display. Um, so keep that in mind when working with this. 